हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल हेलो गाइस इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ वी कैन मेक ए स्मॉल कैलकुलेटर टाइप ऑफ एप्लीकेशन इन कॉटलाइन सो फॉर दैट आई हैव डिजाइन दिस लेआउट इट इज वेरी सिंपल टू डिजाइन एच एंड एवरी पर्सन नो जस्ट वी हैव टू ड्रग एंड ड्रॉप द टेक्स व्यू हेयर फॉर नंबर and we have to add the button add subtraction division and multiplication these four buttons we require and this is the layout which i designed one more thing which i did here in this program i am using the view binding to enable the view binding <coughs> we have to make this changes we have to add this build feature and view binding equal to true and then we have to synchronize it what is the advantage of view binding that is the latest technique by which we can avoid the find view by id method so if you want to use find view by id method then do not use it but it is the modern way the latest way to use the to create a objects and to access the object like this this button this button if i want to access this subtext button i want to access this edit text box i want to access so i access by using view binding so what is the way just create a object active main binding why active main because this xml layout name is active main and then at the end we have to add the binding so this class name would be active main binding so if you want to read more about view binding so you can go on my blog at geniusweapon.medium.com website and here you can use the view binding okay so now we have set also the layout of view binding now we are going to make a programming when i click on this add button it should give the addition on subtraction should give the subtraction so for that i'm using binding main dot btn add dot set on click listener and here on click listener like this way and here i can write my code for that i can check if binding main dot txt num1 dot txt dot is empty if this is empty okay if it is not empty that means we will do our work and if not empty dot txt num2 dot txt dot is empty here <coughs> then we have to make a sum of these two values binding main dot txt num1 dot txt dot two string to int now we have to plus it again i have to add the value of another edit text also that is the 2 now i can display the toast then application context then here we can say sum equal to plus sum and here we display toast dot <coughs> short length dot show and here for else condition we can also display toast
we can give please insert value like this similarly <clears throat> we can make the coding of all other button also like <coughs> subtraction then multiplication then division so what i have to do just make the change here in place of but add we have to put sub because a subtraction button and here i can subtract the value from 1 to second and here i will display the subtraction of the value like this <coughs> similar way i can change to div button division and division i will change it to a division and i can change the name of this object as div and here i can pass div and here i can pass a division of two number then i can give it multiply here i can multiply it and here i can pass mul and we can say multiply <coughs> so this way we have made the code now i have to click on this to run it now if i click on add button <coughs> it will say display please insert value click on subtract so it will display please insert value if i click on division it also say please insert value so first of all i have to enter the value here so i am inserting for example 45 and then i insert 58 i click if i click on the sum it will display sum equal to 103 if i click on subtraction so it will display sub equal to 13 if i click on division it will display <coughs> division because it's a small uh, and it is it is also bigger one if i say multiply then it is a multiplication but in place of 58 if i say 55 and i click on division it will also show <coughs> 9 so this way you can say that we have made application in kotlin by using view binding also just a simple calculation the calculator small calculator application so we can make same kind of application in kotlin and uh, we also will make the use of checkbox and radio buttons in future videos for that watch my new videos also that's all in this video